Hello, today we will talk about serum ferritin. What is ferritin? Why this test is done? In what condition it increases and decreases? About this, some basic information I shall give you. What is ferritin? Ferritin is a storage form of iron. It is a protein that binds and stores the iron. What is serum ferritin test? By this test, we measure the amount of ferritin in the blood of the patient. Through this, we can have an idea about the stores of iron of a patient. Why is this test done? If there is a suspicion of iron deficiency anemia or anemia of chronic blood loss, serum ferritin may be asked for. Apart from these conditions, in case of iron overload also, this can be asked for. Serum ferritin has a special importance in differentiating anemia due to iron deficiency and anemia due to chronic diseases. In case of iron deficiency anemia, serum ferritin will be less. But in case of anemia due to chronic diseases, serum ferritin will be high. How is this test done? This test requires a blood sample which is usually collected from the arm of the patient. Is there any special instruction that is given before the test? Although there is no special instruction given before the test, the sample should be taken in the morning. What conditions can cause decreased serum ferritin? Conditions like iron deficiency anemia and anemia due to chronic blood loss can cause decreased serum ferritin. What conditions can cause increased serum ferritin? If there is iron toxicity, hemochromatosis or iron overload due to repeated blood transfusions, serum ferritin may increase. Also, in chronic inflammatory diseases, serum ferritin may increase because it is an acute phase reactant. So, in conditions like rheumatoid arthritis or lymphomas like Hodgkin lymphomas can also have high serum ferritin. 